Uh, one versus two this week. You've been a part of these before, but that's that stand out. What do you see? Uh, you know, we've always looked forward to playing Notre Dame, and uh, this is going to be only our second road game of the year. So we're outside today and the rest of the week practicing, uh, trying to emulate what we're going to see. You know, field turf outside and that kind of thing for our goalies and our players. And they're great. They play great defense. Uh, it's going to be a great game for college lacrosse. I think great defense may be an understatement, right? After the last week, they shut out Ohio State. How, how crazy was that to see? Yeah, like pretty crazy. You know, I think Ohio State uh, just beat Denver, uh, you know, a few days before, the weekend before, and they turned around and uh, go out to Notre Dame. And it's not bad, bad of a trip for Ohio State and, and didn't put up a point. So it's uh, my hat's off to Notre Dame. They're good from one of the field to the other. This has turned into a pretty good rivalry here ever since uh, the Big East days and now last year two one-goal games. Uh, where does this matchup sort of fit in with the other games you play? Well, you know, I, I think uh, with the exception of, uh, you know, a conference championship, you know, we met in the Big East in the conference championships, and last year with them in the ACC conference championship, those are pretty big ones. So uh, to go out there and, and have number one play number two, it's, it, it's, it's just great. We're excited for the opportunity. Coach, I wonder if you've seen any of the reports that come out recently about Hayes and do you have any reaction to that? I've already made my comments on that. Is he going to turn any time? I've already made over? my comments on that. Do you have any update on Randy? Uh, you know, I haven't talked to, you know, we had yesterday off, uh, we had to take a day off this week, so we did it uh, on Monday, and I have not talked to the trainers today. He seemed to be in good spirits and moving okay, all things considered. What did you see from Tim out there last week in his place? I, I thought he was very good. I thought he executed very well. Uh, he went to the goal a couple times, very strong. I wish he had done it more, actually. I think that he was out there with two guys that have a lot of experience and was just trying to fit in. Uh, but very pleased with, with what he was doing in practice during the week, and that's why he was out there in the game mm -hmm. uh, you know, against Duke. Mm -hmm. You mentioned he goes in with Dylan and uh, Kevin. You think that kind of throws off the chemistry at all there, or do you think it worked out pretty well? I think uh, it's kind of some old chemistry there with uh, Dylan and Tim playing in high school together. So uh, you know, I think they're very comfortable with one another, and Kevin fits right in. The guys, Kevin and uh, Dylan, like guys who, who run the offense well. They want to know where... Uh, players are going to be where they're supposed to be because timing is important as far as finding open people and feeding open people and I think Tim fit right in. Coach, I know you talked a little bit about